Good afternoon, greetings from the Institute of Global Professional IGP, greetings from the Institute of Global Professional IGP. Thank you all for joining us and staying with us till the end. Honorable Knowledge Seeker, today I am your host for the afternoon. My name is Bazun Dasha, I am from Bangladesh. Dear Knowledge Seeker, I am proud to be associated with IGP. IGP is a social and answer for International Education and Training Institute. In last three years, we already served 35 million plus Knowledge Seeker from 100 plus countries. IGP is internationally recognized and globally accredited. We are to more than 450 plus profession and 4500 plus organization in a city of global professional is an education and said that provides social work globally recognized and reputable we serve student community resource providing holistic social work and education we believe that is not effective prints one is just by for informal education so we provide effective training and consultation to generate profession generation all over the world we distribute our services locally nationally generally to students job seeker job holder and also for learners, the respective campus location and distance learning platform we are an occupational and dependable institute igp is one of the famous online institute from all over the world our vision is education is not a business product it's a part of our human rights based on our vision we are trying to reach all corner of the world for free webinars, seminar courses our quiz competition mentoring and counseling etc on the other side, we are also trying to offer more than 100 premium services for free, like a don't portfolio website, resume builder, cover letter, motivation letter, and one knowledge platform for gathering their knowledge, which can upgrade all day. Kids learning game, website free course, converse sites, and many more. We help to empower you to learn to meet their expectation and remain become highly skilled people. We implement several training program webinar and offline online courses for your learner by professional trainer, speaker, and coaches. Our session are conducted by globally renewed professional to develop all kind of views and promote the education of the rivalries. Study, you cannot do anything here from now on you have to participate in life quiz competition on our website we click on our website now you can check all of our previous webinars with verified e certificate now it's easier and time only because after the session we will not provide any code for certification you have to take part in one exam after that if you pass you will receive your certificate otherwise not but you can take part in an exam till that you cannot you have to take part in one exam for that. If you pass, you will receive your certificate, otherwise not. But you can take part in an exam only immediately you pass. If you are an IGP speaker, you can download all your previous certificate, speakership certificate. If you are a host of IGP, you can download the certificate of gratitude. 
If you are an LFS competition winner, you can download a certificate of participation. If you are selected for lifetime membership, then you can download a certificate of lifetime membership easily. Besides this, if you participate in an award function which organized from my support with IGP, you can download it also. You can easily prepare and download 18 types of research certificate from our website. Is what you mean? Certificate of Global Professional Membership, Certificate of Global Influence of the Pandemic, Certificate of Active Knowledge, Certificate of Social Activities of the Pandemic, Certificate of Achievement and IGP Knowledge in Campaign 2020. Certificate of Achievement and IGP Knowledge in Campaign 2021 and 2022. Certificate of Participation Web Messages 1. Authentic Assessment in Teaching and Learning. Certificate of Participation Web Messages 2. Teaching English as a Foreign Language and Assessment. Certificate of Participation Web Messages 3. Digital Classroom Engagement Tools. Certificate of Participation Web Messages for the new trend in education. Certificate of Participation Web Messages 5. Apis Learning Leadership and Manager Skills. Certificate of Participation Web Messages 6. Trend and innovation in mathematics education. Certificate of participation web series seven. Certificate of participation web series eight. Art in teaching a special program in the arts. Certificate of participation web series nine. Twenty first century tooling teaching mathematics. Certificate of participation corporate ambassador. Certificate of participation campus ambassador, which you can prepare and download within a minute. From now on, you can participate in thousand plus international level courses with very very certificate teaching. This for teacher held this for parents held this for teens. Geification tools for teachers. You can join IGP alumni. You can check out our free student services website for free and many more. Dear IGP well wisher, we promised previously, but lack of taking a problem, we will late sending you on time. This is a great opportunity to collect your previous condition. We solve all issues from our website. You can pass out everything. You check out the video for all of the details. It's a cordial request to check out button and pages on our website. She will like and sell you benefit. Thank you, but note that without an account of login, you cannot enjoy our service. At present, we are going to start our 1987 webinar, which name is Research Methods for Management. And today, our speaker member name is Professor Dr. Ashok Kumar Gupta. He is from India. Before I hand over this to our speaker, sir, I must share a little bit about him. Provost Wall Inventor University. Chief Managing Director, Research Foundation of India. Now, very important moment for me to invite our speaker to IGP with his presentation. Now, very important moment for me to invite our speaker to IGP with his presentation. Hello, sir. Good evening. Hello. Hello. Sir, Am I audible? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So, the stage is here. You can start your presentation now. Can I proceed? Yes, sir. You can start your presentation now. Okay, okay, okay. Hello, everyone. This is Professor Dr. Shukmar Gupta, Provost World Innovators University and Chief Managing Director, Research Foundation of India. Happy New Year to all of you. Today, we are going to discuss research methods for management. This is flower you have seen. Now the question arises, what is research method for management? A research method for management is a comprehensive guide to the design and conduct of research in management related discipline, such as organizational behavior, human resource management, industrial relations, and the general field of management. Research. Research is a detailed and careful study of something to find out more information about it. Research is defined as the creation of new knowledge and or the use of existing knowledge in a new and creative way so as to generate new concepts, methodologies, and understandings. This could include synthesis and analysis of previous research to the extent that it leads to new and creative outcomes. 
what are its type research is one word is to search or investigate exhaustively according to the american sociologist al robert baby research is a systematic inquiry to describe explain predict and control the observed phenomena it involves inductive and deductive methods inductive methods analyze an observed event while deductive methods verify the observed event scope and research research to search or investigate exhaustively research is how individuals and business collect and analyze data accurate and relevant research guides key business decisions including marketing plans staffing decisions and expansions and critical data like environmental impacts health care and social characteristics the scope in research refers to the boundaries and extent of a study defining its specific objectives target population variables methods and limitations which helps researchers focus and provide a clear understanding of what will be investigated importance research is a good method of learning about a certain subject researchers conduct lengthy studies and experiments to get insightful findings and collect and analyze data by providing us deeper understanding and knowledge about the topic this process helps us make better judgment where we use the research research allows us to pursue our interest to learn something new to hone our problem solving skills and to challenge our self in new ways working on a faculty initiated research project gives us the opportunity work closely with a mentor a faculty member or other experienced researchers research process consists of a series of systematic procedures that a researcher must go through in order to generate knowledge that will be considered valuable by the project and focus on the relevant topic in some ways each research study is unique since it is conducted at a different time and place there are several steps in research to conduct effective research you must understand the research process steps and follow them here are a few steps in the research process to make it easier for you identify the problem evaluate the literature create hypothesis the research design describe population data collection data analysis the report writing identify the problem finding an issue or formulating a research question is the first step a well defined research problem will guide the researcher through all stages of research process from setting objectives to choosing a technique there are a number of approaches to get insight into a topic and gain a better understanding of it such as a preliminary survey case studies interviews with a small group of people observational survey 
Next step is evaluate the literature. A thorough examination of the relevant studies is essential to the research process. It enables the researchers to identify the precise aspects of the problem. Once a problem has been found, the investigator or researcher needs to find out more about it. This stage gives problem zone background. It teaches the investigator about previous research, how they were conducted, and its conclusions. The researcher can build consistency between his work and others through a literature review. Such a review exposes the researcher to a more significant body of knowledge and helps him follow the research process efficiently. The next step is create hypothesis. Formulating an original hypothesis is the next logical step after narrowing down the research topic and defining it. A brief solves logical relationships between variables. In order to establish a hypothesis, a researcher must have a certain amount of expertise in the field. It is important for researchers to keep in mind while formulating a hypothesis that it must be based on the research topic. Researchers are able to concentrate their efforts and stay committed to their objectives when they develop theories to guide their work. The next step is the research design. Research design is the plan for achieving objectives and answering research questions. It outlines how to get the relevant information. Its goal is to design research to test hypotheses, address the research questions, and provide decision-making insights. The research design aims to minimize the time, money, and effort required to acquire meaningful evidence. The, this plan fits into four categories exploration and surveys, experiment, data analysis, and observation. <coughs> the next step is describe population. <coughs> Research projects usually look at a specific group of people, facilities, or how technology is used in the business. In research, the term population refers to the study group. The research topic and purpose help determine the study group. Suppose a researcher wishes to investigate a certain group of people in the community. In that case, the research could target a specific age group, males or females, a geographic location, or an ethnic group. A final step in a study's design is to specify its sample or population so that the results may generalize. The next step is data collection. Data collection is important in obtaining the knowledge or information required to answer the research issue. Every research collected data either from the literature or the people being studied. Data must be collected from the two categories of researchers. These sources may provide primary data and secondary data. The primary data includes experiment, questionnaire, observation, interview. The secondary data categories are literature survey, official, unofficial reports, and approach based on library resources.
data analysis. After collecting the data, we have to analyze the data. During research design, the researcher plans data analysis. After collecting data, the researcher analyzes it. The data is examined based on the approach in the system. The research findings are reviewed and reported. Data analysis involves a number of closely related stages, such as setting up categories, applying these categories to raw data through coding and tabulation, and then drawing statistical conclusions. This researcher can examine the acquired data using a variety of statistical methods. Now, after that, you have to write the report. After completing the steps, the researcher must prepare a report detailing his findings. The report must be carefully composed with the following in mind. The layout. On the first page, the title, date, acknowledgements, and preface should be on this report. A table of contents should be followed by a list of tables, graphs, and charts, if any. Introduction. It should state the research purpose and method. This section should include the state scope and limits. Summary of findings, a non-technical summary of findings and recommendations will follow the introduction. The findings should be summarized if they are lengthy. Principal report. The main body of the report should make sense and be broken up into sections that are easy to understand. The last is conclusion. The researcher should restate his findings at the end of the main text. It is the final result. Research paper. A research paper is a piece of academic writing that provides analysis, interpretation, and augment based on in-depth, independent research. Writing a research paper requires demonstrating a strong knowledge of the topic, engaging with a variety of sources, and making an original contribution to the debate. Research methodology. It is the specific procedure or technique used to identify, select, process, and analyze information about a topic. In a research paper, the methodology section allows the reader to critically evaluate a study's overall validity and reliability. Research methodology planning. It may be noted that the context of planning and development, that the significance of research lies in its quality and not in quantity. The need therefore is for those concerned with research to pay due attention to designing and adhering to the appropriate methodology throughout for improving the quality of research. The methodology may differ from problem to problem, yet the basic approach towards research remains the same. The research methodology is a process that includes identification, selection, 
and analysis of information about the topic. It is a tool utilized for accomplishing desired objectives. In the research methodology section of the research paper, you need to explain the procedure which you execute for performing research. The elements which you should include while writing the research methodology section of research or type of research you are performing, techniques you will use for data collection, the method that you will apply for data analysis, reason for selecting of a specific method. I planning the research methodological approach. First, define the approach to use the performing research. Write the problem for which you will undertake the study. At this step, it is very much important for you to provide a proper explanation of the type of information you intend to gather for answering research questions, the different type of methods which you can utilize for gathering and analyzing information. They are quantitative method, qualitative method, and mixed method. Data collection. After providing the introduction of the research approach, which you will utilize, you need to provide a complete detail about research method that you will use for performing the study. At this step, you must highlight the tools, process, and material that will utilize the accumulating facts and making the selection of participants. Quantitative research tools. Quantitative methods involve the collection and analysis of objective data, often in numerical form. The research design is determined prior to the start of data collection and is not flexible. The research process interventions and in data collection tools that is, questionnaires are standardized to minimize our possible bias. Quantitative research techniques and tools. It is generally used to explore values, attitudes, opinions, feelings, and behaviors of individuals. Data collection methodologies such as interviewing, observation, discussion, review. Unlike quantitative data collection, Qualitative data collection can be more flexible, allowing the research to incorporate emerging themes in the ongoing data collection. There are some limitations also. Management is the process of planning and organizing the resources and activities of a business to achieve a specific goals to most effective and efficient manner possible. Efficiency in management refers to the completion of tasks correctly and at minimal cost. Management is how business organize and direct workflow operations and employees to meet company goals. The primary goal of management is to create an environment and lets employees work efficiently and productively. Functions of management. It is the process of planning, organizing, staffing, directing, controlling, and available resources effectively and efficiently for achieving the goals of the organization. These interrelated elements of the management process are called functions of management. Functions of 
management are differentiated into two parts managerial function that is planning organizing staffing directing and controlling operating function production marketing purchasing finance and personal managerial functions are common to all enterprises because it does not vary from one organization to another management is the act of harmonizing the five m's man money material machine and method features and characteristics of management goal oriented universal activity continuous process social process dynamic activity group activity distinct process both science and art at profession multidisciplinary in nature principles of management are the basic rules and philosophy that every manager has to know and apply their concepts in organizational success it is found that successful all managers have depth knowledge of their principles the division of work authority and responsibility discipline unity of command unity of direction subordination of individual interest to general interest <coughs> remuneration centralized and decentralization scalar chain order equity stability of tenure of personal initiative state decapo at the core of the principle union is the strength that is teamwork every successful organization has one thing in common which is effective management it is foundation of organizational success management is core function of every organization and its importance is never seen ignored research methods and process in any organization managers at all levels need accurate and timely information for managerial decision making whether the decisions made at the technical tactical or strategic levels good accurate and timely information always leads to a better decision gathering of information is done through a sound and scientific research process each year organizations spend enormous amount of money for research and development in order to maintain their competitive edge accurate information obtained through research leads to enormous benefits <coughs> research includes scientific and inclusive thinking and it promotes the development of logical habits of thinking and organization research provides the basis for nearly all government policies in our economic system research has its special significance in solving various operational and planning problems of business and industry research is equally important for social scientist in studying social relationships and is seeking answer to various social problems the types research can be classified on the basis of application on the basis of objectives on the basis of extent of theory on the basis of time dimension criteria research is half complete when the objectives or purposes of it are clearly spelled out objectives should be quantified so as to avoid any ambiguity unless the concepts associated with the research topic are explained clearly it is not possible to make the work understandable to others 
it is necessary that every step followed in the process of research is explained fully. The research design adopted for the study should be clear and match with the objectives. The researcher should be honest in reporting the facts and revealing the flaws in the work. Data is the basis for all research work. Hence, extreme care must be taken to compile the required volume of data so that the conclusions are relevant and scientifically derived. Every research work should be based on carefully selected analytical tools. More knowledge of the tools is not adequate for intelligent application of them in the research work. Conclusions of the research work should in, emerge from the data and analysis. Browsing conclusions from other research work should be registered and it is inevitable. Then it should be used only for validation of the conclusions. The research work is incomplete without acknowledging the sources of various facts or data. Referencing footnote, bibliography, and several other minor points like punctuation, page numbering, etc., should also be conforming to the standard prescribed. Apart from being scientific and logical, the research should be useful to the society. Research plays a major role in the various functional areas. It is mainly used for taking important decisions in their respective areas. The following are the role of research in each functional area. Marketing, finance, HR, production, entrepreneurship. Application of research in marketing. For decision making, market research, survey on demand, product research, customer research, sales research, promotional research, risk management on collaboration, research for market development, research on marketing and each of competitors, research on formation of marketing strategy, research to build a competitive advantage. Application of research in finance, break-even analysis, capital budgeting, ratio analysis, portfolio management, financial crisis management, decision making, risk perception, investment analysis, financial planning for salaried employee, strategies for tax saving, research to assess the perception of mutual fund investors, research on investment pattern and preference of retail investors. HR, training and development, recruitment, manpower planning, labor welfare study, administrative rules, performance appraisal system, leadership style, problem identification, conflict management, research on MBO, research on historical approach, comparative approach. <coughs> Production, supply chain management, planning, testing new products, <coughs> prototype development, guaranteeing adequate distribution, in-house research, is required for professional and self-development of workers through training and mentoring. Undertaking research can help a company avoid future failure, studying the competition, 
new technology approach, strategic module for overall production and distribution, operational module for production and sales synchronization, R&D for fully utilization of the machine. Entrepreneurship, proper planning, market situation, barriers in a startup, diversification and reverse strategy, existing competitors or substitutors, competitive advantage, differentiation from others, investment decisions, government rules and regulations, social culture and practices to utilize the opportunity. Measurement in research. Measurement is the process of the observing and recording the observations that are collected as part of a research effort. There are two major issues that will be considered here. A measurement scale is used to qualify or quantify data variables in statistics. It determines the kind of techniques to be used for statistical analysis. There are different kinds of measurement scales and the type of data being collected determine the kind of measurement scale to be used for statistical measurement. Nominal scale, ordinal scale, internal, interval scale and ratio scale. Measuring variables and research. Measurement is a process by which we assign numbers to indicate the amount of some variable present. Sometimes the number assignment is easy to understand, that is speed measured in number of seconds. Sometimes it is more arbitrary, one for male, two for female, etc. Likert scale, non-comparative scale for measuring attitudes. Management research. The managers increase need for more and better information, the availability of improved techniques and tools to meet the need, the resulting information overload. Importance of research in management. The role of research has increased in the field of business and economy as a whole. It provides the no knowledge and skills to solve the problem and meet the challenge of today's modern pace of development. The following factors simulate people to conduct an inquiry of management dilemma. Increased role of information technology, active role of stakeholders and cutthroat competition. No matter how good the team of how efficient the methodology, if we are not solving the right problem, the project fails. Be not afraid of growing slowly. Be afraid only of standing still. None of us is as smart as all of us because we require team spirit. Research is creating new knowledge. Research is an organized method for keeping you reasonably dissatisfied with what you have. It is important to get results from experiment, but the most important is the process in getting that result. Take what you can use and let the rest go by. The most important thing in communication is hearing what isn't said between the line. Information is not knowledge. We talk on principle but act on motivation. Thanks. Any question please? We have taken the references from various sources and the link have been shown over here.
Hello. Hello, it is over from my side. Hello. Thank you so much sir, for a rich content presentation which can impact our knowledge seeker surely. After your presentation, I hope our knowledge seeker can learn something new which are only intention. Learn and go together IGP knowledge seeker once again. Thank you so much sir for your presentation. Now sir, it's time for our question answer session which is the one more valuable part of our regular webinar. Honorable sir, please stay with us. After a short video, we will back in our session part 2 which is the question answer part. We are IGP knowledge seeker. Please ask your question in the comment box as much as you want to. Thank you. After question answer, we have a webinar certification and online quiz competition. Dear IGP knowledge seeker, please ask your question in the comment box as much as you want to know from our speaker. Thank you. After question answer, we have a webinar certification and online quiz competition.
sir welcome back to our participant dear igp knowledge seeker please ask your question in the comment box as much as you want to know from our speaker thank you after question answer we have a webinar certification and online quiz competition dear igp knowledge seeker please ask your question in the comment box as much as you want to know from our speaker thank you after question answer we have a webinar certification and online quiz competition Our first question is from Liutim. Explain its operation in details about data processing, validation, editing, coding, classification, tabulation. Thank you in advance. Thank you, Mr. Braha. Uh, it is very good question that uh, operations in detail about data processing validation, editing, coding, classification, tabulation. The first step in the research is to collect data. Data are in the raw form. We have to make them into our information. So analyzing the data is supposed to give the information. Say X is related to Y and X, suppose uh, the, uh, we are studying the age versus height of the student. So on one axis, we'll plot age and on the other axis will plot height of any student. Then we will gather the data from the available sources. Say from our class, we can collect the data that the age is something 21, 22, 23, 21 and half, 22 and half, and we'll measure the uh, height of those students. So we'll make X and Y independent variable. Then we'll plot them on a graph sheet. So the conclusion would be like that. If the age increases, the height also increases. So this way we can process the data. Okay. Thank you. Thank you so much, sir, for your answer. So there is no more questions from our participants. So once again, thank you so much, sir. Uh, sir, again, a question from Kingway. Sir, Ashok, um, kindly explain these terms in research validity and reliability. Thank you in advance. Explain its operation in detail about data processing. This is over. Activity one. It's time for another learning part of session queer. Is there any question? No, sir. There is no more questions from our participants. So once again, thank you so much, sir, for your time in RGP. We have learned a lot from you with new topic.
it will add some value to our day to day activity along with our academic and professional growth honorable sir hope to see you again with a new topic and a new date thank you sir take care honorable sir before we move to the next if you want to leave this studio you can Dear IGP Nalasi, it's time for the webinar certification. This is the most attractive and powerful part of our regular webinar. After a short video, we will start our webinar certification. After webinar certification, we have an online quiz competition and quiz certification. Dear IGP Nalasi, it's time for the webinar certification. This is the most engaging and powerful part of our regular webinar. After a short video, we will start our webinar certification. After webinar certification, we have an online quiz competition and quiz certification. Certification process. Visit www.edoigp.com. Please make sure your presence on our website. Find a running session and get enrolled. After watching, coming part one, move to the next user learning test passing. Mark any person in back. In back to download the download the certificate in PDF for JPG. For your attention, I'm going to share the procedure again. Visit www.edoigp.com. Please make sure your presence on our website. Find a running session and get enrolled. After watching coming part one, move to the next user learning test, passing mark 80%. Pass back to the course again to download your certificate. If failed to retake the quiz, download your certificate in PDF for JPG. Dear IGP knowledge seeker, it's an announcement from IGP. Most ever to a better surprise again for our members. IGP 2024 Global Professional Membership. Please use this link for direct contact and with our team. And I given the link in the comment box. Please check the comment box. So by using this link, you can be a mem global professional membership. I think I'm um, IGP 2024 Global Professional Membership. If you want this, you have to click the link. I already give the link in the message. Sorry, in the comment box. Dear IGP knowledge, it's time for the most engaging part of this webinar, which is an online quiz competition, which is a regular webinar activity. We change a few process for online quiz competition. Note that after life, no one can participate. Now time for the online quiz competition. To join the online quiz competition properly, please follow my instruction carefully. Now time for the online quiz competition. To join the online quiz competition properly, please follow my instruction carefully. Visit www.edoigp.com and sign up or sign in. Without this, you cannot join live quiz competition anymore. Browse the live quiz button or give a link from the session name and join with the log website or user account. Click join and wait for a few minutes for NG others to join and join online live quiz competition. After the quiz, you will issue a certificate for top 10 as previously, which you can find on our official Facebook page and group instead of Global Professional. After a short video, we will start our quiz session.
people, we are going to start our quiz session right now. Our first question is, what is the most important reason for understanding research method? Option one, so you can be a psychologist. Option two, so you can evaluate into and make informed decision. Option two is the right answer. Hundred percent people are right here. Second question is method of secondary market research. Option one market analysis, media frustrated research. Option two market analysis, academic journals, government publication, media. Option 2 is the right answer. 100% people are right here. Third question is easy structure for research method. Is it option 1 or option 2? Option 2 is the right answer. 88% people are right here. Our fourth question is the acronomy for research method is. Is it option 1 or option 2? Option 2 is the right answer. 63% people are right here. Our next question is triangulation is used in mixed method research for. Is it option 1 or option 2? Option 1 is the right answer. 63% people are right here. Our next question is what research method did Fred use for its research on lethal hands? Is it option 1 or option 2? Option 1 is the right answer. 38% people are right here. Next question is what are the correct method for qualitative research? Is it option 1 or option 2? Option 2 is the right answer. 63% people are right here. Very question is what are the current methods for qualitative research? Option 1 RCTs, queries, experimental case control, short study. Option 2 RCTs, queries, experimental case study, short study. Option 1 is the right answer. 38% people are right here. Our second last question of the session is method of collecting information for andrography research. Option 1 or option 2? Option 2 is the right answer. 100% people are right here. Our last and final question of the session is informal research method are used for option 1 conducting experiment, option 1 routine tasks.
Option 2 is the right answer. 38% people are right here. Congratulations to our online quiz competition in top 10. Congratulations again. We will take a few minutes for finalize the result. After that, we will issue our online quiz competition certificate on official Facebook page and group instead of Global Professional. Congratulations to our online quiz competition in top 10. Congratulations again. We will take a few minutes for finalizing the result. After that, we will issue our online quiz competition certificate on official Facebook page and group instead of Global Professional. Congratulations to our online quiz competition in the top 10. Congratulations again. We will take a few minutes for finalizing the result. After that, we will issue our online quiz competition certificate on official Facebook page and group instead of Global Professional. At the end of our session, we can say properly feed your skill, never stop learning, cause life, never stop teaching us. Be happy as the safe. See you again and again. We want your participation in every program. If you want to live a happy life, try to evolve not a people or things, all but I understand. Before I saw hit the unlike button, I again want to thank all IGP knowledge seekers for your active participation as always. See you again in the next session. Thank you.